Now, today's phone tap is very interesting. Uh, you'll, you'll see for yourself. The letter came in saying, Dear Elvis Duran and the Z Morning Zoo, both my mother and father have very short tempers. Therefore, bing, they're perfect for a phone tap. You're going to love them. We're a very, very Jewish family, and my parents take our religion very, very seriously. I just started going to college, and my parents' biggest fear is I'm going to get hooked up with someone who's not Jewish. Oh, yeah. I think it will be hilarious if someone from the zoo calls my house asking for me and made it obvious that maybe we're hanging out, but maybe he's not Jewish. <laughs> my parents will plot. <laughs> Yiddish. <laughs> will plot. This comes to us from Julie. All right, here's how it goes. Let me set this up for you. TJ the DJ called Julie's dad at home and told him he was looking for her because they needed to plan their date for the weekend, okay? Mm -hmm. When dad found out his daughter Julie was dating an Italian guy, he hung up and called Julie immediately. This phone tap picks up with Julie returning her father's call, and here we go. Hello? Hi, Mom. Yeah? Uh, is Daddy upset about something? Yes. Can I ask you something, Julie? I am not understand where this guy comes off calling. He's Italian, for God's sake. What's the matter with you? Well, you got along good in class, so... What the hell does that mean? We he could be a rapist. You're he very could friendly. be a murderer. He could be anything. No, I, we really got along good together. I don't really see a big problem. See, he's not Jewish. There's not, there's not even no talking. I don't know where this is coming from. I swear to God, you go to college and you come out a different person. Taking her out of school, that's it. I got another year of this. I'll kill myself. I'll kill I think... myself. Are you crazy? Forget about it. Call Morris and uh, I'm going to tell Israel and I'm getting her out of school. It doesn't mean I have to worry about you. If it's dark and you're not home yet, then you wonder why I worry. Then when I call you up a dozen, 15, 20 times and you don't answer the phone and me and Daddy keep on calling and calling and calling like everybody bad of you. We don't stop calling and you just don't pick up. I don't and have a problem without this. It's a very big sin for you to go out against your religion. An yeah. Italian doesn't go out with a Jew, and a Jew doesn't go out with an Italian. Didn't you always tell me you like you think a lot of the Italian guys are cute and everything? You told yeah, me. but I don't go out with them. I don't marry them. I don't kiss them. I don't do anything. I, I the nice people. Law. Are you, you crazy? Upset? Would you be upset if I did something with him? I would die. I would die. And I'm kosher. I don't know. I, I, they're not kosher. They're not, there's nothing about them. They're not their lips. Their lips are pig. I don't know. You can't. You, you always told me that they were bigger in the pants, and that's why you like them so much. Oh, my God. You don't repeat what I say. Oh, my good God. Oh, my God. Good. I was going to go out and have a good day now. Oh, my God. A stomach. I got to go to the bathroom. I got constant diarrhea. This is ridiculous. Oh, kill me with a knife. Kill me with a knife. What the hell did I do to deserve this? I have no idea. All I do is stay home every day, clean the f***ing house, and make you dinner, and that's what you do. Don't act like that. And I make you dinner, and every night, and now... <laughs> is it against your religion if we hooked up a little bit? And... Oh, oh, it's more than against your religion. God will strike me. I don't know what he'll do to me. Forget. I don't need this sh in my head. Let me speak to Daddy. Yeah. Are you really upset? What are you talking What are you dealing with an Italian for? We got all good in class, and... What? I don't, I don't give a shit. Yeah, Julie, I'm pulling you out of that school. If it wasn't for school, you'd never see this guy. I don't really think that's a fair thing to do. It's not a fair thing? It's fair that you're going out with an Italian guy? We're nothing like that. I, don't I thought it's... you were smarter than that. You really disappointed the hell out of me just now. You want to get me sick? You want to kill me? This is the way you do it, what you're doing now. Then I'm going to die. Then you're going to be happy you can do whatever you want. Hold on here. Speak to your mother. I'm too nervous. Hello? Hello? Is she still not saying it's okay after all this? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Are you f kidding me? Oh, my f God. Hello? Who's this? Oh, this is Robert. How you doing? First of all, let me tell you something. Yeah. We stick with our own. You stick with your own. That's it. Well, That's I, I, it. I, I, it's not kosher. We believe in everything kosher. Hello? Hey. Hi, sir. How you doing? I'm very upset about the whole situation. We're... Religious people, you're not the same religion. I got a sir. cross on my neck, and I believe uh, in, uh, you know, well, the we don't believe in that, sir. Oh well, well, you should. I beg your pardon. You should believe in that. I'd like you to see me in person and say that to me, fella. That's the right religion, you know. I mean, oh yeah, it is. Yeah. That's the right religion. Yeah. How about you coming over here and telling me that? Well, I will when I meet and you. I'll put you to a f***ing wall. I'll show you who. When I meet you and we talk about our relationship. You hey, know, look, yeah. there's not going to be any relationship. Well, there is going to be one. Oh, how would you like to bet on that, pal? It, st it started three weeks ago. Oh, yeah? Well, yeah. it's going to end right now. Yeah, as a matter of fact, come here, baby. Give me a kiss. You mother... F you mother... I don't like you. I don't like anything about you. And if I see you, I'm going to break you in ten little pieces. 
How do you like that, fella? I'll bring over some spaghetti and meatballs for dinner. How about that? You mu... I don't want to eat any, any of that crap. You guys, you guys make crap. Dinner is a joke at your house. I should come over there and beat the f***ing living s*** out of you. Well, that wouldn't be very religious now, would it? I will kill you, you son of a bitch. You mother, you don't know who you're f***ing with. Please, hang on. Here, take the phone. Hello? Julie? Yeah? You get home right this f***ing second now! Do you understand that? Yes. Yeah. Right now! If not, I'm coming over there, and if I find this guy, I'm going to go to jail for killing him. You understand me, Julie? Do you understand me, Julie? I understand, okay? Right now! Five minutes, I want you home. Because if I go over there, you're going to be sorry, and this ass is going to be sorry. Okay, okay. Right now! Hello, sir. I'm back on the phone. Why don't you come over here? Should I bring my pasta dinner? You bring anything you want. How about, how about you bring anything you want? How about your daughter naked? How about that? You m <laughs> bastard! You. All right, well, I want you to come right this minute. Before I do that, I gotta tell you that your daughter just phone tapped you on Z100. Dad, it was a joke. What? You're on the radio. Get out of here. <laughs> what? Hey, Dad, this is TJ from Elvis Duran and the Z Morning Zoo. Z Morning Zoo, right? <laughs> yeah. I remember Z Zoo when I was a kid. But who's gonna pay for the heart attack I almost had? <laughs> There you go, just another, oh another little happy phone tap. <laughs> all right, all right, no guilt needed. Uh, you know what? Mom and Dad mean business. Oh, yeah, they know who, who they, they want their daughter to hook up with. They made it very clear. TJ, you're awful. By the way, if I was a father, I would never want TJ around. No. <laughs> well, there you go. Thank you so much for your phone tap <laughs> idea. And uh, Yeah, that was yeah. good. <laughs> <laughs> what else can you say? I know, you know, that's not unusual. Parents, parents and family traditions, very important. Oh, yeah.